Welcome to Mobile Application Tutorials. My name's Nigel. Okay, we're creating a new series here and it's going to be about Android Fragments. In the first episode, we create the Android project and then we'll be actually implementing a fragment from scratch in the code. And the functionality of that fragment is going to be downloading and displaying an image using the Glide library and similar to what we did in a previous tutorial. And once we've completed the code for that, we're also going to add an image view and a progress bar in a layout file, which will be referenced from the fragment when the fragment gets inflated. And finally, in the main activity, we're going to talk about fragment transactions and how you can load a fragment using the fragment transaction. In the next episode, we then talk about how you can switch between fragments replace one fragment with another fragment. And so what we do first of all in this tutorial is we use the F5 refactor command to make a copy of the fragment file and its corresponding layout file. And then we make the appropriate alteration so that we load a different image. And then after that we set up a menu. So the way we were going to uh, change fragments is by just using a simple menu with menu items and just select the, each item to select between the fragments. And again we'll show you how you can use the fragment transaction just to switch between fragments. In the next tutorial we talk about the navigation drawer and how we can use a navigation view inside that drawer to show a list of items to select. We still reference inside the navigation view the same menu that we did before but this uh, this time we're implementing the left to right swipe button to implement that and then it's just a matter of adding a listener to the navigation view in the main code itself and implementing the code in a similar way that we've done in the previous menu switching tutorial. In the following tutorial we'll talk about the toolbar because the current toolbar you initially get supplied with the Android project is not synchronized with the navigation drawer. So when you select on that toolbar, nothing happens. So we create our own toolbar and then we set up our action bar uh, toggle drawer and that will link the toolbar with the navigation drawer. So when you select on the toolbar, you can open the navigation drawer instead of doing the left to right swipe. The final episode is implementing a view pager. And that allows you to swipe between fragments instead of using the menu or the navigation drawer. So first of all, we do have to add the view pager inside the drawer layer itself. And then we have to create a fragment pager adapter just so we can send the fragments as pages to the view pager. And then finally we do need to ensure that all the fragment requests are redirected through the view pager itself or else we can have multiple fragments opened if we don't redirect them through the navigation drawer. The first episode in the series is currently available. I will leave a link in the description. If you do want to get all the episodes straight away, there will be a one-off fee of $10 for that. And you can buy it through the actual website itself. And there will be a link in the description how to get to that part of the site. I hope you enjoy this series and thank you for watching.